Welcome back ladies and gentlemen, Tankers of Blitz Universe, an update 4.3 preview video on the really sexy and glamorous subject of crew skills. Yeehaw! Um, World of Tanks features obviously a unified crew, there is no need to train a crew for every single vehicle you have to drive in the game, or you want to drive in the game. So that means if you um, have your tank fully mastered at 100%, your crew can start training crew skills. There's a small catch however. If you want to uh, train crew skills for light tanks, for example the VK2801, you have to use a uh, light tank obviously. You have to use medium tanks if you want to train medium tank skills. Um, well, you have to <laughs> drive a heavy if you want to uh, train heavy crew skills. And you would have guessed it right, thank you very much. You wouldn't have to drive a tank destroyer like this one, the Flat Panzer, if you want to train tank destroyer skills. Um, so. Those things haven't changed. That's still in update 4.3. There are a few cosmetic changes in update 4.3 and the first one is readily uh, viewable over here. There is a little bit of text plus an icon showing that I have maxed out all the skills fully trained 100% on tank destroyers. And that's the same for medium tanks, heavy tanks and indeed light tanks. You can see uh, the buttons have changed slightly the icons and if you click it over here the other big thing Thing. One of the big, big things um, is readily apparent. There is another tier in crew skills. And they used to go, uh, go up to tier 5 only. Crew skill uh, tier 6 was added later and now we have crew skill tier 7. 1.1 million of crew experience is needed to tra fully train 8 crew skill. So there's 3.3 .3 in total for light tanks, 5.5 uh, for mediums, 5.5 for heavies and 5.5 for tank destroyers. But the other big thing and which I'm really happy about is the fact that you don't know you don't longer need uh, to use your free experience to speed up the training of crew skills. You can now use elite experience. And how do you get that? Um, the veterans of Blitz have probably accumulated lots of free experience uh, on or elite experience on tanks and just sitting there going to waste because you have to use gold to convert it to free experience and I don't know if you want to use gold to convert it to free experience or not. Uh, so it's just well probably sitting there in uh, in a big bin of uh, elite experience. You get elite experience from um, using your tank, driving it, researching all the modules plus tanks uh, that um, uh, succeed after that. Uh, tank you have. So the VK2801 over here, I have all the guns and the turret research and the engines and then the tracks and I've researched the SP1C. No need to buy it but uh, you have to just have to research it. The tank then becomes elite. It gains elite status and all the uh, experience, combat experience earned then goes into a big ball of elite experience and that big ball really chock full of <laughs> experience. You can now use that on Crew skills. Um, Wargaming have come up with a cunning plan to um, to distribute that elite experience. If you use just that experience, you will get uh, a one-on-one, -on -one, 100 percent um, acceleration of your uh, crew skills. So that means if you use one million. 1.1 million of elite experience on light tanks, then you will train 1.1 million of uh, crew skills. If you use credits, you can um, speed them up by 200%, so that means 1.1 million of elite experience gives you 2.2 million of f uh, crew experience. And as you would have guessed, it, there's also the option to use gold, which gives you triple the crew experience needed. And there's a lot of experience in this talk and it's already rolling around. Um, but no need to worry, no need to panic, Mr. Manoring. There will be a lot in the game added as well to lead you through all the bits and pieces. Um, currently trained skills are changed immediately without confirmation. No need to ask about that and you will want to... yeah retrain those skills obviously. Um, if you have a skill trained then you can select another skill. There's no possibility possibility now anymore in update 4.3 to, uh, to reset skills. Um, so they've removed that a uh, little bit over there. And there's also one thing 
in here, you don't have to long, no longer uh, uh, click on a button to see what cruise go you are training and how far you've progressed along that line. It will be readily available and viewable over here. A small progress bar will show up. So very convenient. Uh, and that means just one less click. Um, why is this important? Um, I think it's a good idea. It gives uh, gives the veterans of Blitz like me, for example, a, uh, a useful uh, destination for their accumulated elite experience. Um, and if you have played the game for a very long time, then yeah, you can really, really, really gain from having those uh, crew skills trained. As you can see, this one over here, which one is good? Uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, camouflage, really. If you have crew skill, Seven trained, you get a 21% increase of vehicle concealment um, be, uh, or added to the base value. So, having a few tanks in your garage, at least one of every sort of or, or type of vehicle, I would really recommend that uh, to new players as well uh, to train uh, crew skills because those are the little bits that can add to uh, the gaming gaming experience and can really add to the fact that you have a tank that's just a little bit better in terms of uh, of of the other ones of of the red teams so yeah not like I said it isn't very exciting <laughs> at all um, but it's going to be there an update 4.3 um, crew experience can still be accumulated you can already see it I've played a few games on heavy tanks on the test server and a few on uh, tank destroyers so so I think in the future, somewhere along the way, we'll probably see a crew skill uh, tier 8 or something done about that. But as for now, update 4.3 will bring tier 7 crew skills and the possibility to train with elite experience and not just with free experience. That's all, ladies and gentlemen, for today. I thank you all and I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers, happy tanking!